What's up guys, Mutt Viles here, and as you guys see, the coin value is a little bit low. We're going to be going over a couple of cards that came out, I'm also going to show you guys the new additions for the team. Now, if you guys though are pulling packs, let me know what you pull, because last night I actually got a little bit lucky, but the thing with it though was, I opened it like an idiot before that, but well, what are you going to do? Because I went up two Ultimate Legend Fantasy Packs that you get at level 79, as you guys see though, we are one more level away from 80, and as soon as we get to level 80, I will post that video as well. And I got 97 overall Ray Guy. So I will show you guys a little bit later on what I used it for. But we got two more Combine players till Friday, until, not Friday, Monday in packs. We still have McKinnon and Kelsey in for, till tomorrow. We have John Ross and Josh, excuse me, Josh Allen as the new limited times. And we also have Donovan McNabb as a limited. We also got. Two new heroes in the game, which are Night Train Lane and Walter Payton. So we're gonna go over them right now. Do I think it was really like a good idea for them to bring out Walter Payton? Um, that's a yes and a no. Yes, because for people who can't get as you am right here, for those who can't get CJ Two K, this is another substitute. He has 95 speed, 96 excel, and agility, and elusiveness, 92 trucking, 94 carrying, 98 break tackle, with 71 catching. The second one that came out today, Night Train Lane. This card is a community favorite. But everyone, one thing everyone in my opinion is not happy about, 92 speed as a base for a corner. 96 agility, 6-1, 96 jumping, 93 man, 95 zone, 96 press. 94 Excel with 97 play rec. We're going to go back right now to champ. And honestly, I would not mind this card at all. I might try and get him because I do like the way he plays. Plus, we've been rocking with the same two corners, Dion and champ, for the longest time. I'm just honestly waiting for champ to get a new card. But we'll see how he plays. Card looks good. The one thing I know with this card that's always good is his hit power. So he can hit hard for a corner. For when he played. And let's see what he has. 92 hit power for a corner. But honestly. Laying the boom. I didn't know that existed in this game. And going for a million coins. Donovan McNabb. The limited time hero. 90 speed. 93 throw short. 94 mid and under pressure. 96 on the run. 93 play action. 98 deep with 96 throw power. With go deep. He'll be up to 99 throw power. The card looks good compared to Sam, but honestly, I don't really know if I want to rock Donovan McNabb. I just, I don't know what it is, though. It's just with him sometimes, though. I just don't like the card. I just don't like the way he plays. That's just my personal opinion. Oh, I've had more coins. I think it's an A. George tonight. Let me see. Uh, no, never mind. I thought that was an A. George tonight for 249. I thought he went for like 270. Nope, I was wrong. Um... Let's go take a look at the Bengals because that's where I believe John Ross should be at a 97. And yeah, here he is, 722,000 coins. Fun fact, when, I believe it was Madden 17, you guys know what I'm talking about. There was a pad that was out that gave you an elite um, combine player, or like the base combine player to get the set done, and a quick sell. The first one I've ever pulled was this John Ross. This was the card I pulled, so honestly, it's a little place in my heart. This was honestly the best card I pulled, and the other one I pulled was Leonard Fournette. So, John Ross and Fournette were my two guys who I pulled for the combine promo, but that was during the draft, the draft promo. 99 speed, 96 catching in short, 92 catching traffic, 93 min, 98 deep, 94 spec catch with 91 jumping. Comparing him right now to Jerry Rice, printed the fastest receiver in the game. That's what he's known for running a 4-2-2 in the 40-yard dash. And also, guys, let me know this in the comments. Bang was the thing about trading him. What do you think he's worth, and where do you think he's going? Let me know in the comments below. Um, And the last one that came out was... Where is he? Oh, here we go. 99 throw power, Josh Allen. I couldn't get the name I have for some reason. Josh Allen, 98 throw power. Obviously, with at least one tier of... Uh, go deep or just John Madden. He'll have 99, 88 speed, 93 short, 91 mid, 89 deep, 90, 87 under pressure, 96 on the run with 93 play action. Comparing him right now 
His size, his speed for his size is really good. I honestly like it. So, honestly, with the Bills, I think that's my Gossel one. At first, I thought he was going to be the bust when it came to last year's draft because of the way he played in Wyoming. But watching him play, it's just I'm learning now more and more that I think it was just a program he was in because I think Wyoming was a D2 school. And he's playing that, playing the way he was playing. He has no targets. How the heck is he supposed to produce at a high level if he has no weapons? But, hey, he got drafted, I believe, was seventh overall from the Bills. So, congrats to them. And good luck in the future because you're going to be playing us in Sam twice a year. That's going to be a fun duel. But, nah, we're going to go right now. As you guys see, we're going to look at the lineup quick. Lorenzo Neal, he is powered. I did power him up. But he was only out to a 92. Said to exchange his other card. Keep in mind, though, the next time I do a big upgrade, it's going to be on the offense. 100% is going to be next. Defense, I see we are at 96, but we got 99 Sean Taylor added to the team. 96 Aaron Donald, 96 Cleo Mack. Hopefully tonight we'll have 97 John Randall. And by the time we get to level 80, 96 Lawrence Taylor. That's what I'm looking at, though, for this defense. It should play 100 times better. Also, I did get this as well. Here it is. This is my new defensive playbook, the defense multi, alternate defense multi, because it has like every single formation in the game, which is like uh, four three, three four, five two, uh, nickel, dime, dollar, uh, big nickel, everything. Let me know what plays are really good in this playbook. Like, give me some suggestions on what's good to run, and I'll try my best to practice it. And hopefully, we can play better. So. That's going to be it, though, with the team. We are low on coins, scout, and training, but we will get that back up. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know what you guys pull down in the comments. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Twitter. My link will be in the description below. Hope you guys have a great day. I'm Also, also one more thing. I'm not going to stream tonight. I'm really not feeling it today. So maybe tomorrow I will. It depends how I feel. But I'll let you guys know then. Other than that, I'm out.